What is stock and why we invest in stock? What is stock? If you are new to investing in stock, you need to know what stock is and how you can invest in stock. Stock is considered one of the best asset class to generate you income or capital gain. A stock is a share in the ownership of a company. The person who owns share is called stockholder, shareholder or investor and he is entitled to the company's assets and earnings in the form of dividends in accordance to the percentage of stake he holds. There are two ways in which you can make money in stock, dividend income and capital gain. Dividend income. Companies pay a portion of their corporate earnings to investors in the form of dividends. Dividend payouts can be annually, biannually or quarterly depending on their dividend policy. Capital gain. You can also profit by selling the stocks at a higher price than what you originally bought. Capital gain usually make up most of the gain you get from stocks. Your actual investment returns will be the sum of dividend income and capital gain. Why we invest in stock? Here are four reasons. One achieve financial independence. This isn't about quitting your job or retiring early but have the option to do so. It's about achieving financial self-sustainability without relying on job. Such option allows you to live your life at your own terms and isn't that what most people dreams of? To put your money to work harder. Your money has to be parked somewhere whether it is in your wallet or bank accounts. But the problem is both are not offering the returns that can impact your wealth. 3 beat inflation. First, we need to know what is inflation? Inflation is the general increase in prices of goods and services. In other words, you buy less than you can with the same amount as the value of your money fall over time. It's like dropping coins whenever you work, eat and sleep. The average inflation can range from rate in 3% to 10% and the average savings account rate is less than 3%. This means that your money is losing its value at the rate of every year. For retirement. Many are worried that their savings and retirement funds are not able to catch up with their retirement lifestyle once they are no longer employed. 